For weeks now, much of the media has been showing the same image of Venezuela. Protesters facing riot police and tear gas. Headlines say the opposition is facing a government crackdown which is responsible for more than two dozen killed so far. Is this what's actually happening though? Of those killed thus far, three are attributed to state security forces, while two of the dead are members of police themselves. There are also 16 police under arrest in the deaths of two of the protesters. But what media aren't saying is that 10 of the deceased are attributed to violence from the protesters themselves. And while the vast majority of opposition protesters have marched peacefully, not all protests are peaceful. Some opposition leaders have called for violence and some right-wing activists have been found with firearms. Government offices and even hospitals have been attacked and local shops looted, accounted for at least 26 deaths. Tear gas has been used by police on opposition protesters attempting to break police lines and head to the areas where government building and government supporters are. The narrative being pushed by most media is not only incomplete, it's dishonest and does little to help achieve what most Venezuelans want, peace, and solutions to the real problems that our people face daily.